Hello guys, how are we today? So I'm doing this makeup tutorial inspired by Priyanka Chopra who is a Bollywood actress and an extremely gorgeous mashallah and so let's get started with the makeup tutorial so first I'm applying this yellow based concealer to my eyelids just to cancel out any darkness and I'm just applying that to my eyelids then I'm going to take an e.l.f. blending brush and NYC Smooth Skin Sunny Bronzer in well, obviously sunny and I am just going to apply this to the crease I'm just going to blend back and forth Then I'm going to start off with the Naked Basics palette and I'm going to take the shade Faint which is kind of like a taupey brown and then I'm just going to apply this to the crease as well just to deepen it a little more. Because we're not going to apply that much colour to the lid area I want to emphasise the crease more. We're going to be applying a very heavy eyeliner in this tutorial but it's quite simple to actually do so don't worry about that. Once all that is blended in I'm going to take this reddish brownish shade from the Bobbi Pin Eye Collection eye palette and I'm also going to apply this to the crease. Then I'm taking a flat shader brush from e.l.f. as well and I'm taking this yellowy shade that's from the Naked Basics palette as well and I can't remember what the name is and I'm applying this to the whole visible lid area. I'll link down all the names of all the products and the shades that I use in the description box below and then I'm just deepening out my crease and blending all of the colours together using the same crease brush that I used before. Now for the fun part, after this we're going to do the eyeliner and I'm taking an Avon Glee Mystic eyeliner in black is black. So because the eyeliner is more stickier, when lining your eyes you're going to push back at the lash line in small strokes which is going to make it easier to get the wing. Keep the thickness of the eyeliner the same on the top lid for the bottom lash line, the wall line and the lash line. The outer half of the lower lash line is going to be more thicker and then join the end with the end of the top lash line. So everything meets, if that makes sense. Okay. Then I'm going to take the black shade from the Naked Basics palette and I'm just going to place this on top of the eyeliner that we just did. This is just going to make sure that the eyeliner stays. See, I told you it was simple. Then I took my eyelash curlers and I curled those lashes and then I just apply lots of mascara. I'm not sure what mascara I used here but I'll link it down below. Then I'm going to teach you salmon colour concealer and this is just going to cancel out any darkness under the eyelids, under the eyelids, under the eyes where our bag area is basically and then I'm just applying that and then I'm going to go in with my Rimmel um, foundation the 25 hour foundation and I'm just applying this with my fingers first and then I'm just taking a sponge and I'm just patting, patting this bumping this into my skin just to create a flawless effect then I'm taking the NYC big bold bronzer and I think it's in Manhattan. 
and I'm just applying this to my cheekbone area to make it look like I have cheekbones then I'm going to apply this to the sides of my nose, my temples and then under my chin and then under my uh, lower lip as well Then I'm taking the e.l.f. blush and I'm just going to apply this to my cheeks as well, just on the outer half of the cheek area. Then I'm going to take, I'm going to take my highlighter which I accidentally dropped on the floor from the naked flushed palette that's it and I'm just applying this to the uh, highest parts of my cheekbones I'm going to apply this to the bridge of my nose my cupid's bow and that's it and then we're going to move on to the lips and I'm applying this NYC lip stain first to my lips which is kind of like a corally red color and then I'm going to take a uh, quite a darkish pinkish lip liner and I'm just gonna apply this on top and then finally I'm gonna take um, that shade from the MUA lip gloss palette and I'm just gonna apply this to my lips as well and then that will be the look complete so I hope you enjoyed it and I guess I will see you later please thumbs up if you like the video subscribe if you want to and let me know in the comments down below what kind of other videos you want me to do and I guess I'll see you later bye